Now, firstly, this is only Disney Britain. These, this statistics is only for all the, the staff that work for Disney in Britain, which is which is around three thousand. And this re, this article is a year old, but it's still completely relevant to today. I, would, I wouldn't be surprised if this has changed very much. But what it shows is that Walt Disney staff in Britain who are, who are male are paid 22% more on average. And including bonuses, it raises to 41.9%. So Disney released a movie based on feminism and they're paying their staff, their male staff, up to 41.9% more. Okay? <laughs> who, who falls for this stuff? <laughs> it's just... You can't, you can't take, you can't believe what Disney are doing. Now at its stores, the male staff members were paid 19.8% 19 more on average and have received a whopping 77.2% more than women in bonus payment. So the men working in, working in the, in the stores are not only paid more, but they receive 77.2% more in bonus payments. And yet Disney are trying to sell a feminist movie, okay? So you have Britain, Okay, it's only a small sample, but it's free. It's still three thousand people, so it shows a significant sign of what what they could do. They pay the they pay the male staff twenty two percent more, and the bonus payments seventy seven percent more. And yet they're trying to sell a feminist movie. Who falls for this nonsense? If you if you've fallen for this nonsense that that Captain Marvel is some sort of feminist movie, movie and that Disney can be trusted, just look at this stuff. Look at the stuff that's out there. 77.2% more bonuses for men and yet they're they're gonna get they're gonna make hundred they they might make a billion dollars out of Captain Marvel and yet they're paying men 77% more in bonus payments you can't you can't make this stuff up who falls for this nonsense okay it's so sad they're, they are turning feminists into customers whilst paying men in bonuses 77.2% more who for who falls for this nonsense I can't believe it. It's what it is. It's marketing. I've said it before. Disney are marketing this movie as some sort of feminist, some great feminist movie. It isn't at all. It's just a way for them to make money, and it ends up more in the pockets of men. The twenty-two percent more money for the for the men, and the bonus payments for the for the male staff who work in the stores, seventy-seven point two percent. And yet, and all right now, this art this article is a year old. But this movie was announced was announced four years ago. So four years ago, Disney said we're gonna we're gonna release Captain Marvel. We're gonna release a female-led movie. Yet three three years later, they're still paying the men seventy-seven point two percent more in bonuses. Who falls for this nonsense? If you think that Captain Marvel is like some sort of feminist movie or feminist movement, it, you don't don't be fooled. Please do not be fooled. They're, they are paying their male staff 77.2% more in bonuses and and people fall for it. I, it's, it's really sad to see. It's really sad to see how a company can do this. They pay the, sta they pay the male staff more, they give them 77.2% more bonus and people think they people think they can trust them. If you can trust a company that does this, then more for you. You, you need to wake up. <laughs> Just... I can't believe it. I can't believe that people fall for this rubbish. It's completely fake. It's completely false, phony, feminist marketing. Disney are trying to turn about a hundred million feminists into customers, and yet they're doing this. They're paying the fem they're paying the the male store workers seventy seven point two percent more in bonus payments. It's just a robbery. It's a scam. It's it's this needs to be called out. And this this is only three thousand people. Okay, if you if you multiply this across the whole of the staff around the world, I believe it's somewhere around 100, 150,000 staff around the world. I might be wrong, but it's it's a significant number. Okay, so that's just that's just, that's just Britain, three thousand, and they're getting seventy seven point two percent more bonuses. You just think how much internationally more men are getting in bonus payments more than women. You could be talking millions, many millions of dollars that men are getting. In more in bonus payments than women and yet they release a feminist movie come on come on wake up wake up people if you're a captain marvel fan you've been you've been sold a lie you've been sold a con okay you, you're gonna go and buy a ticket to see captain marvel and that money is gonna go to men <laughs> okay there it is there <laughs> we know it's gonna happen 77.2 percent more bonus payments than women <laughs> please don't be fooled 
if, if you've bought a ticket try and get your money back if you've gone to see it don't go and see it again don't don't buy the dvd because it's just it's just a scam this movie is a scam 77.2 percent more bonuses for men than female and that's the store workers they're not well they're not well paid store workers i would imagine i might be wrong but I'm, I'm, they won't be great they won't be well paid i won't i won't believe yet the men are getting 77.2 percent more in bonus payments come on come on this is shocking and, and millions of people around the world are going to watch this movie thinking oh captain marvel feminism yeah let's go let's go let's go fem let's go become feminists let's go let's go support feminism let's go support the me too movement and yet disney are rubbing their hands and when the men want the bonuses they'll go hey here are male you're you're a man here's your 77.2 percent more bonus than a female <laughs> you're falling for it please do me a favor this this can't continue this 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 is embarrassing okay it's clever marketing i hand it to them you know it's very sophisticated very clever marketing but basically right if you if you're not if you're a feminist you you have to support captain marvel if you dislike captain marvel it means you're even not a feminist or you're sexist that's what it boils down to yet behind the scenes disney are doing this they're not feminists feminist a feminist company wouldn't give their male staff 77.2 percent more bonus than the female staff and would they? If they, if they? That's not feminism. This is the shocking, appalling, and that, they've been found out. That's why. That's why the reviews have been bombed, review bombed on on these on Rotten Tomatoes and IMDb and these review websites because of things like this. Uh, just it's just sad. Don't fall for this nonsense. This this movie is a scam, and they've, they've put these statistics out themselves. Okay. This is from Disney's own statistics. This isn't made up. This is factual information from Disney that shows they are paying male staff 77.2% more than women in bonus payments. You fall for it. You don't fall for it, please. Don't don't have anything to do with this movie. It is a con, a con job.